Okay, let's go to Gearscape. All surviving crates have been recovered and resources transferred to our stores. Nice. I guess we got two medkits, two magazines, uh, another magazine for sniper rifle, and one grenade. Fair enough. On completing a mission, all gathered items and resources are added to your overall supplies. Soldiers are fatigued during battle, losing one stamina point per turn. When stamina falls below 20%, the soldier will suffer an action point penalty in the next battle. Your soldiers will recover stamina and health while resting on the base, as long as the base has a functioning living quarters and medical bay. Return to your base so your soldiers can recover. Sure. Personnel. Equipment. Okay, what's the training? Soldiers can increase strength, feel power and speed, as well as acquire new abilities by spending skill points. If soldier has used all personal SP, they can use Phoenix SPs, which, is, which are common for everybody. Soldier can only acquire abilities for their current level or lower. Upon reaching level 4, each soldier has the option to specialize in an additional class. The last row of abilities represents personal aptitudes the soldier is born with. Once you are adjusted your soldier stats and abilities, go to the research section. Um, okay, research. Atmospheric analysis, sure, that's fine. That's it, we just have to activate, activate this thing again. Okay, let's do it. Research complete. Reprogramming of our satellite systems has revealed the extent of our new mist outbreak. Uh, the region site are uh, coastal sea regions as in the previous two incursions, but the activity level seems higher, posing a serious threat to remaining life on Earth. Heavens caught within the mist will be at risk of attack, so we should explore mist-covered regions truthfully and defend any heavens trapped within them. Our gascope monitoring system have been updated with current mist coverage. Okay. The mist represents the prog progress of Pan Pandora virus as it spreads through the globe. The Pandoran mutations will attempt to build colonies on, area, on areas of land covered by the mist, which will then attack nearby heavens. To meet the, this threat, you will need to produce equipment. Select the manuf manufacturing band. Man. Weapons, vehicles and armor are manufactured by fabrication plants, provided the required research has been developed and there are enough resources available. Items take varying amounts of time to produce to speed up the process build more fabrication plants. Manufacture a medkit. Sure, let's do it. Instant. Nice. Um, eight. I don't need eight. Um, okay, what else? Satellite uplinks allow area scan to be initiated, revealing new sites of interest. The more uplinks there are available, the more simultaneous scans can be performed. An area scan can only be performed by an aircraft centered on its location. The scanning zone will expand over time, revealing new sites. Perform an area scan. 
And the scan area button, blah blah blah. Okay, let's do it. Congratulations for completing the tutorial. From here on, it's all up to you to survive, explore, and become humanity's salvation. Check the Phoenix Phoenixpedia for more information about the game. Now you must find out what happened to the Phoenix project. Research the Phoenix archives. Sure, let's do it. Ooh, nice. Uh, Phoenix archives. One day, one hour. Uh, might as well. Are we scanning right now? Oh, yeah, I think so. That's a lot of points of interest. Like this is getting dangerous. Sundarans uh, Phoenix Archives. After recovering the base and analyzing the databanks that have been left functional, it is clear what Phoenix Point is now the only operating Phoenix base. There may be other bases around there, but we will need to find them and bring them back online. There is no sign of Randolph Symes. But he has left something potentially useful for us. Do we get a cutscene? Randall Symes was the last leader of the Phoenix Project. His great grandfather had been there when it was founded, and he was there to witness its end. When we took back Phoenix Point, we found his notes. In his final days, as the world collapsed around him, he had been working frantically to understand the Pandora virus. Is he a scientist? Somewhere, in the complicated history of the project, in decades of missions and investigations, there had to be an answer. His notes were damaged, too many of the files corrupted. But perhaps, if we could retrace his steps, we could figure out where his journey had taken him, and what the answers he had discovered would mean for us. I mean, do we want to find out if uh, Phoenix uh, project got destroyed? So, why do we think it's a wise idea? Randolph Symes' notes indicate the existence of private retreat owned by Simon's family, used as a place of meditation and research. It may contain information that could help us understand what Symes was trying to achieve in his final days. We should send our operatives to investigate. Of course, freaking of course. Okay, let's put new research. Uh, let's go with recruitment protocols because it's one of the shorter ones. Um, and I guess this is our mission, the same retreat. Okay, let's check one point of interest here before we move for exploration side. Our operatives have discovered a theme park dedicated to a lucrative flat. A novelty boy band made of young hedge fund managers <laughs> who enjoy enormous success with their single Golden Gecko before crashing spectacularly when their second album failed to sell more than 100 copies. The park, like a band itself, was initially thought to be in intended ironically. It is unusually well preserved. Rupert Classy Lad Kane, formerly of a band, now works as an analyst for New Jericho. Uh, Jericho? Uh, in an urgent message, he pleads for us to destroy the park and not let anyone know about it. <laughs> Mr. West does not know about my history with the band. And I don't know what he would <laughs> do if he finds out I was a part of something so frivolous. Uh, it's awesome. Let's dismantle park for materials. Oh. I like bits of uh, bits of story and humor. Okay, explore on our side. Since it's on our way to our mission. 
Uh, for disciples of Anu, heaven of Sipari, a mutated for worm infestation is causing serious problems. The locals had placed their hopes in... I, I don't know how to pronounce this thing, Nurgle? The disciples' greatest military hero, but Nurgle is said to be fighting a series of pitch battles against the Pandorans, and has been unable to help. We could eradicate the infestation ourselves, helping the Haven and creating a good first impression with this faction. Sure, it's good. Um, empty ready slot. How do I slot items in here? Okay, what is happening in the factory right now? Um, we got cannon. Okay, let's put a med kit in radio items and the grenade. Okay, it takes five hours. Okay, so let's take grenade and heavy. Oh, never mind, for six. Like, there's enough grenades for everybody. Him. Our sniper, he has a handgun and sniper rifle, so let's give him ammo capacity too. Hmm. Uh, let's give him med kit too. Give him grenade on the body. Just in case. Uh, and this is an assault, I think. Where do you see his class? I don't know. Training. Yeah, assault training. Same as this one. Equipment. Uh, let's put a grenade. Do we have an ammo? Yes, full magazine. Equipment, uh, med kit. Nice. Okay, are we ready? Let's deploy this squad. <laughs> 